this is Amy and Mark from Chateau de Rosière on a very, very cold day. Not that cold, actually. Well, there's snow. It's yeah. reasonably cold. So Mark's still in his sandals, though, so... <laughs> and today, well, we'd already planned this, but um, Mark says it's not to be scuppered by the snow, so I believe him. Um, we want to do something which is quite exciting. Well, okay, for a bit of a pyromaniac, it's a bit exciting, isn't it? <laughs> We've got, do you remember back last year when we cleared the terraces for the vines and um, we ended up with a huge pile of stumps of the old um, acacia that we ripped out um, and we had to wait till the winter to burn it because of the fire hazard. Well, today we're going to burn. Don't we? Because <laughs> I haven't had enough sleep. Yeah, the, <clears throat> the stumps have had the time to dry a little bit, so hopefully they will, uh, they will burn uh, reasonably easily. We'll still need to shake the pile a little bit because it's full of uh, dirt and stones and um, and uh, so it's, it won't be easy to catch fire, for it to catch fire. <laughs> uh, so I think we'll uh, have to burn some uh, pallets first and, oh, okay. uh, to, to well, dry wood to start a good fire. And then uh, pour the stumps on top of it. Um, but first, we have to go and get a permit to burn, don't we? Yeah. And we have to hope. You, you said it says on the form that um, we need to give two days notice. So we're hoping Mark's going to beg the Mary to let us burn today. Yeah, I'm sure it will be okay. Because <laughs> the snow is not a massive fire risk today. Yeah. <laughs> I, I doubt the fire spreads to the mountain. <laughs> The reason why we have to burn is because the um, we well we can't really do anything else. The pile is uh, too big to be uh, moved away. It's uh, it when the yeah the, the paths are a bit unpractical, uh, so we'd have to do a lot of small loads, and we can't shred either because it's uh, mostly stumps that are all mixed with the stones and. Uh, and dirt, so it would, uh, yeah, it would really damage a shredder. So our really, our only real option is to burn. I have my permit signed by the mayor, so we are clear to, to burn. Did you manage to get the permit? Uh, yeah, I got it. What can I do to help? Um, I'd like to gather stuff to start the fire. Yeah. Uh, so we have loads of old cardboard and uh, things. If you could load all that on the ranger, it would be really helpful. Brilliant. Um, and we can take a couple of pallets to give it a good start. Okay. Uh, and you're going to go and get the digger? Yeah. Yeah. I just got to go and get baby girl and put her in a snowsuit and bring her out <laughs> to <Okay>. be with me. <laughs> well, 
what takes the most time uh, when we do a job like that is usually to get the digger from a place to another because it's uh, quite uh, slow to drive and the, um, the estate is actually quite big. So Juliet has now woken up, which makes life a tiny bit more complicated, uh, but we've already got plenty of cardboard in the ranger and I just need to bring it over to the woodshed to do a bit more clearing. It's quite a good um, excuse actually to, to do a bit of clearing up of all the recycling and things that we store in there during the summer. That baby girl. <laughs> Peppa loves the snow. Well, it's bonfire of the century, so we do need a decent amount of um, cardboard and stuff to start it with, and I hope this will be enough. All right, Missy Moo, how are we going to manage this then? Don't really want to take her in this with all the extra stuff and uh, with it being slippery with the ice and snow. Uh, so, Dave, if you wouldn't mind pushing her up, and I'll take the ranger up, and then I'll come down and meet you part way. Hello. You beat me, even in a very, yeah, very slow digger. You were very slow. I was, I was very slow. Um, also, the fact that the four-wheel drive isn't working on this made it slightly hair-raising going up the hill on, a, on ice and snow. <laughs> okay, so should we start? Yeah, what do you need to do to the pile? Burn it. <laughs> Didn't you say you have to shake out some of the dirt first? Yeah, I've started. I think we can start the, the fire yeah. and shake as it's going. Uh, yeah. And uh, a lot of people ask about animals and things that may have crawled in there. It's not actually a very hospitable environment, is it? Because it's mm. mostly stumps with dirt on. Yeah, and all the dirt has sedimented down the bottom. So I doubt there are uh, many animals in there. And also because and we start it fairly slowly, those who are in there get the chance to um, yeah, they'll vacate. Yeah, they'll run out uh, yeah. quickly. If, uh... Dave, the former chief fire officer, said in all his time burning, he actually never encountered any animal carcasses underneath. They all tended to run out as soon as it was started. Yeah. Did you take some matches? No, I thought you did. I'm on... I was... <laughs> you were in charge of, of the fire. No, no, I was you... in charge of cardboard. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna get some matches. 
Uh, do you want to take the Ranger? Yes. I never remember how to start this thing. top of it to get it but it keeps rolling why, further why away. did you bury the cardboard <laughs> do you need help no no okay let me just try one more go to get that on there that wasn't shall i move the ranger away <laughs> i thought it was against the Okay, I'll be back tomorrow. No, look, it worked a bit that time. Mark's gone to pick Clement up and he's entrusted me with starting the second bonfire.
It's been burning for a few hours now, but uh, I couldn't see any smoke from, uh, from below, so I'm, uh, I want to check that it's still burning. seems to be burning gently, so that's good, it didn't go off. We have a, a nice, uh, yeah, a nice bit of embers down the bottom, so now it's, uh, it will uh, just uh, consume slowly. We should actually have started it from the other side of the pile because the wind is going that way, but we, we couldn't really know at the, at the time. It will probably take a few days or me, uh, even more than a week to burn completely and we'll need to be coming uh, every so often to stir the stumps with the digger. But uh, it started so that's good. Okay, let's go back. It's going to burn gently. 